Well, it's good, guys. Today's the day. Take a last view of the car. Uh, it's sitting right now because we're about to slap on everything. I got everything on here inside the car. You know, set it all up down here and I'll show you guys what we're running and what do you need to do the S14 um, swap. I wasn't running anything that was Q45. It was all S14. Yeah, guys, this is a setup I'm running. I'm running a uh, partial max everything. Um, I'm doing the S14. I got the S14 knuckles over here. And then in order for you, if you're gonna run um, extended lowers, which these you could extend and and do all that since they're adjustable, um, you gotta run the 2004 Nissan Maxima um, inner tie rods. And for the outer tie rods, you got uh, the S14 one. The coilover, it's the S14 with the Q45 top hat. And then everything uh, everything else is S chassis. So, so yeah, that's how you gotta run. And in order for you to run the s14 with your stock brake bolts you gotta make these these hole bigger i gotta get the size i forgot the size that it is but i'll put it up i'll put the size a picture of the size that you need to make that hole bigger so in order for it to work but yeah other than that that's it guys oh me just pulled up gonna do a little quick front alignment <laughs> he lowered it as well it's tucking harder the first piece this shit's not fun doing it in the fucking sun. Now well, we got Roach over here giving us support. Just paint it out. In order if you want to put the, the tension rod, you have to cut these little nipples right here. So you can sit flush. So trying to get the little grinder and the little Dremel. down the nipples and now I could go up freely without it. Well, the nipples nipple. getting grinded down or you worse. Fuck you. <laughs> I roach here. Super. Got the first coil and the knuckle in. Yeah. Fucking extremely hot out here. I cannot right. do this shit. Fucking tweakers over here whistling now. Okay, this side's done. Just got a bolt on that last bolt right there and fix the caster. And we should be moving on the other side. Homies went to get water right now over there. But yeah, this heat's no joke. So we got a little too excited and we threw one of the Yaba Kings on it. I feel sad, guys, but hey, the black with chrome be smacking, no cap up. We're about to lower it so we can flip it to the other side because the sun is not, not it today, boys. Lower it, I'm in the truth. Oh! <laughs> you guys see it? Everything set up how it was. So I got the fronts done for now and the rears, put the rear coils, but I still gotta put the rear arms and everything, but it's too damn hot. Been out here for a good minute. Back at it again, just move the car from over there to here. No problems, went in good. It's just that we're gonna be like crazy over here. I think the caster is a little more forward. But yeah, we're about to slap on the rear arms and get it cracking. So we're gonna raise the engine with these. What we usually were gonna do is, but I'm gonna have to grind these down because they're a little too high. We got pops in the truck. Decided to hop out and trim in those faces while I get these arms inside. All the arms basically almost out. We just need the rear lower. But yeah, guys, we don't need this no more. And for the new one, some shit always has to happen down the block. Got pops out here, sweating. Hey, pa. Que tienes que decirle al güey que 
chocó mi carro. Fucking bad. That's all right. Everything's all in now. Just gotta bolt up the coil. And the side's done. This canopy is putting in work though, for sure. It makes it a lot easier. Yesterday, since I didn't have the canopy, I was like getting drained quick. But yeah, up on my pots. We already got it grinded down. All he has to do is just smooth it down. But yeah, guys, throw it on time lapse and me putting the coil in. Got excited and threw on the wheel real quick. It looks good again. Let's see it from this angle. I think I'm gonna drop it on the floor. Damn. I'm gonna drop it on the floor real quick and then we'll see how it looks. Yeah, guys, the front's still sitting lower. The rear's still a little higher, but it's because of the other size that has not, that's not lower. This side's still super high. But once we do this side, should be ready to go. Yeah, guys. But shout out Pops, been helping me out the whole day. My brother, he's just been upstairs being a lazy ass, but we just need this side right here and we should be done. Como lo ves, pa? Good job, bro. Nice. <laughs> he was like, damn, that's a lot of shit you gotta do to the car. I said, yeah, but we're, we're almost there, guys. It's time to get this thing on the floor and finish it. The headers are on the ground. We're gonna have to raise it because that's just scraping everywhere. I wanna let it shave down, but as you guys see, the street's getting kind of fucking burnt. And we're not trying to get in trouble for that shit. Throw myself on time lapse. Let's get it. Faster than what we thought, huh? Wake the fuck up, man. Everybody go in the comments and tell us for the wake up to stop being lazy. But we're almost there. Just need to take this lower control arm real quick. I had to disconnect the whole axle to get to that ball because it ended up getting stripped, but got it out. I'm gonna take a little quick water break. We got the homie here. Now we got everything out. We're about to throw the arms in. I'm gonna throw it on time lapse again. Everything's in there, take a good look. Yeah. Finally done. All I gotta do is just make those wheels fit. I really like these wheels because the chrome makes it look better. Uh, check out the nice view over there. Really excited guys, I'm cheesing right now. My excitement is like jumping right now to be honest. <laughs> I'm gonna pack up my stuff, get ready to go home. And then we'll get back into this another day. But the most hard part is already done. Well, it's been a minute since I picked up the camera. We're gonna finish it off with some cinematics. I ended up washing the car. Um, still not the best, but we still got a lot of work to go to. We still gotta fit the wheels and everything, but enough being said, see you guys in the next one.